What's up YouTube, Jimmy the Infernape here. And I have some sayings that I hear a lot when I'm buying and selling. And I absolutely can hate them. I'll literally not even sell something to somebody if they say these. I won't even try and make a deal. And by the way, if somebody tries to make a deal with me, I'm open to offers usually whenever I sell something. Good example was up selling some plushies I offer uh, all those plushies I had I said 200 to the shop I understand they make a profit they offer me 180 I told me I'm in the middle of 190 it's fine with me you're just offering a decent offer on them but what stuff I hate are some of the following oh this is for my kid so you're gonna give it to me for like five dollars no, if I have something listed for 35 bucks or $30, I'm not going to sell for $5. I don't care if it's your kid, your aunt, your dying aunt, your dying grandmother. I'm not going to sell it to you for that kind of price. So don't give me a pity sob story. You do that, I'm just like, no. I absolutely hate hearing these sob stories. Okay. I know it's not worth anything, so I guess I'll take it off your hands anyways. If I have something up and it doesn't sell, I'll lower the price accordingly. If multiple people, if somebody says, oh, it's not worth anything, and then I, and then they'll just take it off my hands for free, no, I'll physically just, I'll throw it in the garbage before I'll give it to you for free for that. I'm just saying, I absolutely hate when you say that. Because you're insulting my intelligence as a seller, and you're just saying, oh, yeah, and, this right here is especially bad where I am in my Nary Barrett, okay. Will you ship for free? No, dim bag. If I'm gonna be doing the selling, I'm gonna get you to pay for the shipping. Because it's gonna probably cost me a buttload when I'm in Canada. Usually Canadian shipping, if you're selling it to the United States, it's gonna be at least thirty dollars more than likely. So no, I'm not going to ship you free. I might give you a deal on the thing if you come to me. Yeah, you have this plushie here for $30. With the shipping, it would be like $60. I might give you a deal. Say, hey, I'll do a, cut you a deal 40 with the shipping in. Sure. It's just my thing. No, I'm not giving away Peplop. I have two of them, but no, I'm not going to give them away. It's three in my area, so give it to me. This happened a lot with the Mew code. Damn. Uh, sorry, I just had to write down names. And anybody who, uh, I do end up giving one away, you guys are going to be banned. I don't care that it's not available in your area. A lot of stuff isn't available in Canada. Good example the Evolutions plushies for Max and Y are US exclusives. You're not know, seeing me cry about them, I only have four of them. Okay. I know it's worth a lot. I'll give you half the value. No, if I put something up for there, it's if you, and you offer me half the price for it, I put something up for. I can understand if it's like ten dollars, you offer me five bucks, or I'll come back at seven fifty more than likely every single time. But if I'm saying it for twenty dollars and you offer me ten, I just won't deal with that shit. Or if I've a good example on this was, I have a huge banner. As far as I know, there's none of them surviving for Pokemon Diamond and Pearl. I have asked a lot of collectors, there's none around. So I, I'm going to keep it as far as I know. If somebody offered me $1,500, i will take it. But without that price, I won't take it. Even if somebody offered me four, $1,400.99, no, I wouldn't take it because, well, kind, you set your price. You set that price for him. Somebody come back, and no, you don't take your price. You have to stand firm. I know that uh, this is one that's really prevalent around my area. I'm calling a lot of the buyer sellers. Yeah, I'll give you 10% of what the value is. I know I'm gonna make I know I'm gonna make 30 bucks on it, so I'll give you two bucks on it. No, if I'm gonna give you 30 dollars on thing, I know I'm gonna make 30 bucks on. I'm gonna give you at least 20 for it. Saying in the reseller by the way in my area, terrible. I'm just saying, you guys, 
you're rarely willing to cut deals on stuff. It's either gonna be, oh yeah, another thing I hate, eBay prices. If you have something on there, uh, look up on eBay. Look for what's sold, not for what's selling for. Not what the, it's on eBay right now, buy it now. Yeah, it's buy now, not what people are gonna pay for it. And the number one thing I hate when people doing deals, they get to a location. Oh, I'm here. Uh, we agreed on fifty dollars, and I want it for twenty. No, I'm not changing the price because you're here. If you, that's why I refuse to meet a lot of people because my area they change their prices and say, "Oh yeah, you're here. You might as well sell it." I'm not gonna sell it if that's the case. Okay, this is to a question of all you guys is buy, sell, trade, whatever video game collectors, whatever your collection is, doesn't matter. What do you absolutely hate hearing from people? And this helps YouTubers, what do you absolutely hate hearing? I'm buying something. There's a lot of annoying phrases out there that you guys have probably heard, so I want to hear some of them. And Chimmy the Infernape here, signing out.